Are you looking for the most powerful oversized racket on the market? The new Dunlop LX1000 is an oversized for oversized rackets. We're gonna break it down in this video, tell you what's good about it, tell you what it can work on, tell you if it's the racket for you. Keep watching, check it out, full review coming now. The Dunlop LX1000 is one of the largest oversized rackets on the market with a colossal head size of 115 square inches. This very light racket has an unstrung weight of 255 grams, which equals 9 ounces. The swing weight is 321, putting the balance point at the 14 and a half inch mark, making it 6 points head heavy. It has an open 16 main, 18 cross string pattern and it is extended at 27 and a half inches on a thick beam of 27 by 28 by 26 millimeters. The grip sizes available are one through three where the Dunlop synthetic grip comes standard and it has a sharp glossy gray cosmetic. Now, although an oversized racket is not the typical racket I use, I was trying to play a little bit more continental, a little bit more one-hander, more realistic for the audience that this racket pertains to. I find myself hitting a smooth shot and the racket holding up really well and doing the work for me. It felt effortless. I felt with a 30 mile per hour swing, I was getting a 40 mile per hour shot. And that's really great if you're looking for something to kind of help you out in that game improvement market. The first thing to note with this racket, it is not conventionally strung. You can see it has a throat piece here, which extends the strings longer. Now, the longer your mains are from top to throat, the more trampoline you're gonna have, the more spring you're gonna have, the more power you're gonna have. So this kind of stabilization piece here in the throat allows the racket to be consistent, allows it to hold up, and then this lower throat piece here allows you to get another inch bouncing back each way of extra power, extra oomph, making your shots that much more powerful with less of a swing. In match play, what I found to be very lacking from the ball, and you can see it in the video, is that everything was landing short. As soon as I took a swing, although the trajectory popped off the racket, I got a good deep shot. It wasn't as penetrating. Normally when I hit something near the baseline, I expect it to clear all the way back to the fence or to really go to that back wall. And this was bouncing a couple times before it got back there showing that although it was traveling a long distance on that 70 foot court, it wasn't penetrating like some of the other rackets. Again, cause it's gonna be a bit lighter. But if you're that normal player who might be hitting the short shot, or maybe it's landing in the service box and you're drawing your opponent in, this is a great racket to push them back to the baseline to get some more depth in your shots and to really stay in control of points. Again, as I said, it's not the typical racket for me, so I wanted to review it true to form for all the viewers. And on my volley, it was really excellent to play with. Normally, I have a bigger swing on the volley and the ball was sailing, so I really kept it tame, really kept the racket quiet and allowed the racket to do the work for me. It had a very generous sweet spot. I can hit it almost anywhere on the surface and I was getting a real stable shot. If I hit it in the sweet spot, it was very clean. It was doing well. Again, I did struggle with putting a little too much punch on it and the ball sailing out, but I feel like for the right demographic, for the right player who's got a slow swing or maybe a very compact swing who doesn't want to generate all that swing, then this racket is going to do the work. It's going to be a great fit for them. The Dunlop LX1000 is ideal for an older player looking for some help for the racket as oversized rackets should almost never be in the hands of junior players. 
players looking for added power on very compact strokes anywhere on the court with either a one or two handed backhand would reap the most benefit from this frame and the scores in our solo sports review reflect that. Similar rackets include the Babolat Pure Drive 110, Wilson Triad 3, Head Instinct PWR 115, or Yonix Astral 115. Although this racket is an absolute pain to string with a custom piece provided with each new racket, try not to think of the stringer's misery as you play your best tennis with this racket. And that is a wrap on the Dunlop LX1000. It is over 100 degrees out here, so I am spent. I'm gonna go hit the jacuzzi, I'm gonna go hit the pool. No more court time for me, but if you're at home watching this, let us know what you think of the rackets. Tell us more about your game. We're gonna take that really intimidating wall of thousands of rackets and pare it down to one or two that work for you.